Step two in first grade writing, write, revise, and edit, with a whole lot of talking along the way. How do they get started? A lot like you do, with their notes. Here, these little cuties have drawings that remind them of the ways to save water. First up, the introduction. First graders can write a simple topic sentence to tell readers what they're writing about, but at this age, it helps if they first try to say the sentence out loud before they write it. What would you say in words? Um, it is because... It's important to save water. Because it is very precious. Then they can concentrate on writing the idea down. Next up, the body of their paper, the details and examples to support their topic. In this case, examples of the ways to save water. Here again, saying their ideas out loud helps them get them firm in their mind. So what was your sentence that you were going to say? Mm -hmm. Do, do not play what with the, in the sprinkler or do other things that take up a lot of water. Then they write. To wrap it up, kids can write a simple concluding sentence. In this case, why saving water matters. So, so what? So it doesn't go extinct. So it doesn't go extinct. Finally, even first graders can revise and edit their writing. They can read over their writing and make sure their ideas make sense. And then, with some help, can correct some spelling, punctuation, and capitalization. I need to turn that into an A. Oh my goodness say, good thing we noticed. I need to turn that into an A. At this age, there will probably be a lot of mistakes, so choosing only a few to correct is best. It's more important to make sure they communicated the ideas that they wanted to. So how do you know your child is on track? Well, come summer, with guidance, first graders should be able to write a topic sentence and a concluding sentence, write the body of their piece that includes lots of examples, and do simple revising and editing, checking their ideas, and their spelling, punctuation, and capitalization.